Online privacy is a hot topic these days. People are becoming more aware of privacy issues. So, is there now a need to look for privacy-focused email alternatives to the big tech companies? Today, let's take a look at one of them, Proton Mail. Before we get into the details of the service, let's talk about what is Proton Mail. Proton Mail is a Switzerland based secure email service created in 2014 by scientists who met at CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research. Proton Mail's mission is to make secure and private email communications easily accessible to all. To accomplish this, Proton Mail uses end to end encryption and zero access encryption so that not even the company has access to users' messages. Like Gmail, Outlook and Yahoo Mail, Proton Mail has a very recognisable inbox. You can create folders for Pacific Email's conversations to live. They are filters to action on incoming emails as well. For most users, it might seem like there's little difference between this email service and the other web-based email options. All the benefits to Proton Mail are behind the scenes. To start off, Proton Mail has a free account with limited features. These limits include 500 megabytes of storage, 150 messages per day, one email address, free folders, labels, and limited support. Proton Mail has multiple paid levels, but we're going to concentrate on the plus level as it is geared towards individuals. The plus level will cost you 4 euros a month. This allows you to send up to 1,000 emails a day, increased email storage size to 5 gigabytes, have 5 aliases, and use your own domain name if you want. Finally, Proton Mail also has a professional level, which provides end-to-end -end encryption for any company and their employees. Each employee is billed at 6.25 euros per month to use the professional level service. To me, the plus level seems the best option to choose. The free account could get a little cramped, and I can't really speak for professional level service. There is not a great deal to dislike about this service. The limited online storage for email accounts is the only thing that would bug me. Bear in mind, Proton Mail does not have all the bells and whistles like an email product from Microsoft and Google. Proton Technologies the company that makes Proton Mail are still a small company in Switzerland. You have to understand, they have limited resources. If you're not too bothered about Proton Mail's limited online storage options, then Proton Mail is an email service you should think about using. Thanks to its client side encryption, end to end encryption, and open source encryption algorithms, a free Proton Mail account is a small backup option which also gives you time to decide if you want to upgrade to the paid subscription if you like Proton Mail. <laughs> 